his answer, D. The height of the water jets increases from the mouth to slightly behind the middle of the straw. From there to the finger it decreases again. The water can come out through the holes in the straw. All the water that comes out behind the first hole seen from the mouth must flow past the first hole. Its flow velocity is high, so the static water pressure there is low. Consequently, the water jet is also low. A little less water flows past the second hole because water has already escaped from the first hole. As a result, the flow velocity is somewhat lower at the second hole, so the static pressure is somewhat higher. Consequently, the water jet is also somewhat higher. This phenomenon continues from the first to the rear holes. There, however, other phenomena occur. The water has to flow along the straw wall to the rear holes. In the process, part of its energy is lost in friction, so that the static pressure decreases again towards the last holes.